hope you're all living all right, Johnny. Oh, we're live. We're live. Where are you? We're live. Hey, Kath. If I were you, I'd stand there, love. All right, here. Yeah. Because you can just twist it down and they can see it. Say hello. Do, 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 do. Come on. Seeing what the uh, equipment might pick up. Going to be first. Claire Bear's watching. Oh, look. Claire Bear. I can wave to Claire. I've waved to Claire. Yeah. Don't know why, I'm but I've waved to Claire. Hey, Claire Bear, I hope you're well. H, go on, I wave to H as well. And Kimmer. Yeah. So Don't know why it's not saying. Oh, we'll wave to Cliff. Cliff's on both streams. Yeah, <laughs> Cliff's usually watching hey, about man. three or four streams in one go. Good evening, H. Helen, Amy, oh. Cliff, yeah. Scotty. Oh, I'm going to wave to Scotty there. I'm waving at everybody. So, Stephen, yeah. Louise, hope you're well. Rebecca Sheldon, mm -hmm. Diana. Yeah, move that way and it goes off. Yeah. How is everybody? Off. Kim. Let's get a quick second for everybody to come on. Move that way. It's a shocking night tonight, guys. The weather Try is looked, horrible. K2 will go on floor, you know it cold. Yeah. I was thinking it rained though. Mm. It's wet. Well, it's spoiling. Hello. Yes. Or leave that a bit then. Leave yeah. K2 off for a bit. Yeah. And, um, I'll turn it off anyway. Yeah. How are we all, guys? Everybody well? Yeah. Now, I think that might have been me that's just knocked that it set ball. Yeah. What yeah. the? Oh. Well, at least we've got Remy. Light's gone off. When you've got your light's gone off. Yeah. Hey, <coughs> Randy. Glad you Good evening, Killer Kelly. Thank you for sharing. Welcome, Scotty. Not late. Yep. Carol, Velvet. Hello. Good evening, everybody. <laughs> Lindsay is We've got Lindsay down there. Hello. <laughs> She's down there. I'm under my brolly. She's under a brolly because she can't I'm get in here. Blue. We're in a we're in a bandstand. We well, like a little, little sand little thing. <laughs> Stephen, are you well? So yes. We are here tonight. How long for? I don't know, because it's it's lousy weather. Yeah, absolutely but lousy. It's supposed to be stopping in a bit. It's supposed to be stopping in a bit, so we're hoping. Yeah. We're just we're like trying to keep dry under here for a bit, and then we're going to have a venture out, hopefully, in a bit. Yeah. We are here tonight with... I'm going to blind them now. Yeah, Wenda and Ellen. Well, I know, Bright Lights, from uh, <laughs> White Rose Paranormal. You'll find them on Facebook. You guys on YouTube as well? Just no, Facebook. no, just Facebook. Just Facebook. We have got YouTube, but we haven't got it under, under right. running yet. Just Facebook for now, guys. White Rose Paranormal. Everybody's welcome. Give them a, a visit. Join, like, all that good stuff. So, where have we come tonight? A wet and windy, a wet wild. And windy, wild and horrible place. Well, it's not an horrible, it's, it's a lovely beautiful. place. It's absolutely beautiful. It's beautiful. When the, sun is the weather's horrible. When the sun is right, I'm, I am going to attempt to read this now. And I'm going to come in front of you so I can't see your light. Can we stand this side? I can yeah. turn that one off if you want. Yeah, yeah, go on then, that's better. <laughs> you have to shine your torch up here now, though, because I can't see a bit of paper now. <laughs> it's history. It's got a bit of sand as John. Evening, Steve. Have you got it? Oh, that's I don't know. It. We all right? Are we, are we all right there? Right. <laughs> In the 19th century, there was an enormous increase in the population of this city. In, 18, in the 1801 census, shows the population to be 13,264, most of whom lived on the north side of the Beck. Fifty years later, the popula population had risen, risen to 103,778. This massive increase in population in such a short period of time caused immense problems of overcrowding, poor... In Poor conditions and became much worse. Houses were built without ventilation and owners often left let sellers in order to increase their income. Water supplies were often contaminated and refuse piled up in the streets to be collected infrequently. Sounds like now. <laughs> Once every, every, every two, every two week bin collections now. Working conditions in the mills were equally horrendous. Children and adults worked extremely long hours for small wages at the mercy of overlookers. Oh, it's windy. Um, the mortality rate in the 1840s was especially high. In particular, 
children and wool combers. The average age for tradesmen and labourers was 17 years, while that for prof prof professional men and their families was 30 years. In the insanitary, overcrowded areas, epidemics were frequent. The cholera epidemic in 1849, glad you didn't have to read this, Lindsay, <laughs> resulted in 426 deaths, with the graveyard beginning, beginning to get so overcrowded that bones were coming to the surface and causing a further health hazard. It was necessary to set up a new cemetery. In 1850, it was agreed that the best place for the new cemetery was here, where we are. Thirteen non-conformist businessmen agreed to buy a total of 26 acres of land and this cemetery became a reality. At a great ceremony in August 1854, the bishop consecrated the western side of the cemetery for the bur burial of Anglicans. The smaller eastern section was left for the interment of non-conformists. Two mortuary chapels were built in 1854, but replaced 24 years later by larger ones designed by Lockwood and Mason. The first interment here took place in March 1854. Unlike churchyards, where rich and poor were buried side by side, the ability to pay governed the site of a grave here. In 1855, an order in council closed many of the overcrowded burial grounds one of those was the old Quaker graveyard. The new railway company had acquired the site, so a society, the Society of Friends purchased a small section in this cemetery. They reinterred the disturbed remains of the Quakers in one large grave. Subsequent burials it's getting windy now, are marked with a simple and uniform flat gravestone. During the first year 187 burials took place here from cemetery records it can be seen that the number of interments began to decline from 1900 by 1929 the number had dropped from a peak of 2466 a year in 1898 to 696 in 1928 between 1854 and 1928 105,742 interments had taken place including the bodies that had been transferred from other burial grounds. <sighs> Cliff, I wish you'd stop with this history. <laughs> You've said way too much history. Uh, and I can't read my own writing. So, so there yeah. you go, guys. So, so yeah. The history of the cemetery where we are tonight. Don't ask me to read it out again. No. <laughs> I struggled that time. Yeah. So we have already got... I'm going to turn this light on now. I'll, I'll point it down away from you. Yeah, we've got a bit of We've got a bit of equipment already set up. Wendy's got a spirit box ready to go, and we've got the K2 meter that's switched off at the minute because with the live streams, it's going to be affecting it. We've got the flashy balls and the REM pod. And another flashy ball. And, and another flashy ball. Yeah, we've got two flashy balls. Oh, two, I've got two flashy balls. Yeah. Oh. I know there's more, Cliff. I, I know there were a lot more. That to you. <laughs> you can put that in chat or after. It took me an hour and a half to write that out. So, did you say REM pod had already gone off once? No, no. no. It, it, oh, sorry, it, yeah, K2, but that, we think that worked phones. So, I'm going to take you over to Lindsay, let Lindsay say hello, because I think it's just about stopped raining now, isn't it? It has, it stopped, yeah, the rain stopped, so we might be able to vent it out. No, Steve, I can't. <laughs> it says, I missed what you said, can you read it out again? <laughs> my lovelies thank you for joining i can't believe that we've actually uh, managed to get from the car to at least a half dry point um so yeah so now we can start all those experiments and and have a good night so don't forget guys everything you see family i'm not guys everything you see and hear feel sense anything please pop it into chat because that'll help us with either things that we feel and see or hear um and also you are our paranormal investigators for the night um and yeah so um i can't i'm saying i'll say evening all because i've missed everybody coming in so uh, i'll pass you back up to john yeah, and get, let the I experiments begin <laughs> yeah john gets to talk <laughs> right guys what we're going to start with like I said, we've got the REM pod out. Got 
have we got spirit box handy? Spirit box, yeah, spirit box on. Make sure we do spirit box first. Yeah, I've just got it turned on. Now with the SP7, what I like to do is have it on uh, quite a high speed and in reverse. Yeah. Yeah. Don't speak too soon, guys. That game's coming back. Oh, right. But this might just be... Welcome, Paul. Latter end. Yeah, we are hoping this rain is going to stop soon, guys. So put what you hear in the chat, please, on the spirit box. It's a beautiful place. You will, in a bit, we'll have a walk around. But hey, look at that monument over there. Well, I don't know if that okay. is a monument or if that's actually a grave. Ellen? Is. A monument, that one. Yeah. But we are going to have a walk around in a bit. If anybody knows where we are, please don't put it in the chat, you know. You know the, the score, guys. We will give the location out as we're leaving. Or in a bit. Well, this is right, but they don't even... I hate this SP7, you know. They're not right loud, are they? I've got a speaker. Have you got a speaker on then? My speaker isn't even working. This weather, it's this yeah, weather, it's rain, it's just it's melting everything. Yeah, we can start to take moon now. Yeah. yeah. Internet went it's down today, but neighbour gave me a password. Yeah. Oh, that's cool, Paul. That's, our neighbours won't do that. Yeah. Paul's lost his internet, but his neighbours get password to hers. Wow. So he's on her internet. We got that I one. Do you that get. Just not my neighbours. Just not my neighbours. Can you hear that all right, guys? I presume you will be. All right. Good evening, spirits. My name's John. I'm Linda. I'm Wenda. I'm Ella. We're no harm or disrespect. We're just here to communicate with you and find proof of the afterlife. Could you step forward? Tell us your name. Toys that you can play with. Sounded like German, that. Yeah, it did, it did sound English. You tell us how many spirits are here with us? That's a six. Six spirits? Yeah, six spirits, yeah. Sure. Six spirits. Thank you. Can one of you tell us your name? It's a beautiful place. Are you happy with how this place looks? Hmm? Can you tell us what year it opened? Can you affect any of the devices on that bench? Just try and approach one of them. Try and move one of the balls or touch where the red light is. And they said blue light then, because ours is blue. Did something run? Good morning, Yvonne in Queensland. Do you mind people coming here to communicate with you? Yeah. Give you a voice? Is that Steve then? I thought oh, I was going to say, I need to see up Steve. Yeah. Steve's like Steve's like Steve. Yeah. Steve. yeah. Is your name Steve? Steve. 
Thank you, Nigel. You sure don't want to come in here because that's getting heavier, that rain. I'm dry, honestly. I'm dry, I'm dry. You tell us what year this cemetery opened? Well, how many bodies are buried here? Just radio. Um, Rebecca's picking up. She thinks the six was including us, so there's two spirits and four of us. It's working. Claire heard. Can you put a light on? Can't. Can you put a light on? Can't see a thing. You want me to turn the light down? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. She does need a rain cover, it's really coming down now this rain. She needs to come in here where we are. Total peace and respect for you. You mean you no know harm? I come what? You guys here, I had I come and I couldn't make out the last word. Constance here. Sometimes when you're a bit further away, it's, e it's easier to hear. Uh, yeah, it is, yeah. I'm 40, I thought that said, but... I might be mistaken. Is this still... Oh. That's what I was going to say. Is this still Stephen? Are you 40, Stephen?
M14. Yeah, it could have been. Good evening, Gwen. Stephen, that's 14. Oh. Becky, you can hear the word justice in your head. Stephen, you think they're flirting with each other? Fourteen or forty-eight? I, I, I'm not. I can't hundred percent say which one it was. 40 was the first one that came into my mind when I heard it, but it could have been, I never even thought of 14. Now I'm doubting it, it could, could have been 14. Can you tell us what happened to you? I thought she'd gone. <laughs> Do you want to communicate with us? Is that no thanks? Oh, no, I didn't hear that. I thought that said no thanks. I was too busy thinking to myself about how heavy that rain we're getting. <laughs> yeah. Are you sure you're all right, Sat there? Yeah, I'm fine. I like right Yeah. Yeah, that rain's getting worse, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, we'll turn Sunday. this one off yet. Can I just nick speaker cable back and then uh, I can... Just thinking, because it might be easier, easier for them to communicate, you know, like through the electronics. Yeah. Yeah. As I said, just keep trying what we can try until we as I get some communication. Yeah, I think so. It's really shocking. I don't know if you can see this guy. It's yeah. absolutely shocking yeah, out there. Three Yorkshire lasses hard as nails. What about me? Yeah, three Yorkshire lasses as hard as nails. One sat there on a little blue look. <laughs> yeah, that's little blue for them that yeah. don't know. Yeah, little blue. His little brother of big red. So I'm going to try to get necrophonic on, guys, just because it's easy to set up. Yeah, we are under like a gazebo type thing. I don't think roof's fallen in there, look. So. Oh, this is that one that makes funny noises, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's scary enough to get it out to hotels, isn't it? Oh, I need to swap. I'm gonna have to I feel down. quite peaceful here. Oh. It always feels like we're doing cemeteries and things. Yeah. Think you know it's safe and dry. Okay, four Yorkshire lasses then. Cheers for that. <laughs> Thanks for that. Cheers, Amy. Uh, you've got now. Stop. Oh, I forgot to read Amy. Yeah. Usually, when there's only one fellow with us, we rename him. <laughs> Apparently, I've got I've got to be renamed. Yeah. What are we called? Joanne. Yeah, it could be Joanne. I'm Joanne tonight. Apparently, it's my weekend name. Don't have that. Don't have that. That's better, isn't it? Oh, no, we're going off. 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 We're going
Yeah. Or it yeah, could yeah. be it could be wind because it's quite windy, yeah, isn't it? This might have been a bad idea. Yeah. No, she's got she's got a brolly. She sat under a brolly. Look. <laughs> We keep telling her to come under here, but she won't. She says she's all right. I'm just a tiny here, but you can buy under Brawler. Yeah, but you're probably drying this way out with your Brawler. Can you try and use this device to communicate with us? White balls, black. I don't know, it could be wind. Or is it? I don't think it is. I've never got it. I've never got my balls wet. So, all right, stop. Yeah, my balls are wet. Can you light them back up again? Yeah. Just no moon dropping drops, dropping on them, he's saying. No, but I don't, they are. Want to move them back over the yeah, so I want to set the seal so that the seal, <coughs> the, apart from rain's actually dripping on them. Yeah. But there's no rain dripping on them, but it could be wind, I don't know. But they're in the crevice though, aren't they? So mm -hmm. if you can light those lights up again. <coughs> Now that you know that we're here. Is there a Dean or Constance? Spirits with those names? Are you here with us? She's on Little Blue Paul. Tonight, that's Little Blue. Big Red, we couldn't get in car with everybody in. So, Little Blue. This area is suitable for Little Blue. Wet flashy balls, yep. That's so wrong. <laughs> Could you try and use this device in my hand to communicate with us? You can manipulate the sounds coming out of it to create words. Can you tell me your name? Stephen's still here? Constance or Dean here with us? Just. I don't know. It sounds like just to me or just. No, I thought you said Justine. Justine. Is there a just, is Justine here? You just heard it say necrophonic. Gemma thought she said it said blue. I thought you could say it said stop. Yes. Do you want to communicate with us? Yes. Stop again. I heard stop then. Yeah. What? Is that the rain that's going to stop again, spirit? Mm. I don't know. I don't know. It sounded Forward. like it, didn't it? Yeah, could have been. Oh. Is that windy it's blowing phone about? Mm. Spirits, we've come here, it's horrible weather. And unfortunately, we feel the cold. But we've come here to communicate with you. Do you know, it <laughs> oh, normally tells Lindsay yeah, to shush. It tells me to shush. Yeah, it's got... We've come here to communicate with you. We've come a long way. You think you could step forward and communicate with us? I think it did. Said what? Leave, leave. You want us to leave? You want us to leave? You have to light all three of those devices up. If all three of them devices are light up, I'm leaving. <laughs> In a hurry. Well then, Spirit, if you want us to leave, do you want to light these walls up and this other device? If you're happy for us to stay, don't let them light up. Just leave them as they are. What have you forgot, Lindsay? I can't hold it. 
Amy. Amy just reminded me. Yeah. <laughs> Obvious. Obvious. Yeah. I was looking at one of them other day. They're not. Don't, teeth, they're not. They? There you go. I have to um, pray to Uncle Victor. <laughs> It is now, Amy. Big place. What is this place? <laughs> is there any angels here? It could. It could have been spirit. We're leaving. I thought you said Deacon then. I thought you said something. I thought I heard Deacon. Yeah. So I would actually think, before I said it, I think it's into Deacon, into something to do with church, a Deacon. Yeah, but, but then again, also a name. name. Is it? Yeah. Is that you, Deacon? Is that your first name or your surname? It's surname. <laughs> Paul. Paul. Paul I know there's a lot of burials here, Cliff, but is Paul Deacon relevant? <laughs> That'll keep him busy for five minutes. Yeah, it will, yeah. Keep him out of there for five Paul minutes. Paul Deacon, if that's you, can you come forward? Paul again. Paul, can you light one of these devices up for us? <laughs> I'm not, I'm not repeating what that said. <laughs> yeah. See you next week. Yeah. See you next Tuesday, yeah? Yeah, uh, just said see you next Tuesday to us. There's no, there's no need to swear at us. We don't mean you any disrespect. We don't want you to disrespect us. Shut up. Shut up. Yeah. We don't want any negativity here, spirit. No. Did that say what I think it said then? The P R A T T A word. I don't know. I didn't hear. Scared. We're not scared of you. We're not scared. Are you scared of us? Is that why you're being aggressive with us? Can you guys hear Lindsay okay? Walking. I thought you said one. I thought you said one. Paula. Mm. Is there a spirit named Paula? Can you interact with any of the objects on the bench? Try and move them or light them up or... A what? Healer. healer. Would you a healer? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she yes. She's a healer. No. Yes, they can hear you. That's good. You're going to say, Sonic, you don't clap. You can't not hear my mouth. <laughs> Carol says she can hear you and she's not even got a phone volume on. <laughs> <laughs> she, she, didn't, she didn't really, she didn't really. I'm not getting Carol in trouble saying Damn. <laughs> Amy says we can hear you from next counter. <laughs> it's time. It's time. What, what is it time for, Spirit? <laughs> Shake off. 
Veterans, <laughs> veterans of famous conflicts such as Waterloo, the Crimea, and the Indian Mutiny are also buried there. Here. Really? Oh. Do we have any soldiers here today? Yes. Which war did you serve in, soldier? Do you know, I heard, I heard something that, you know, that whisper that came through. I thought it said, it weren't a war that were listed, I thought it said Boer War. I know there was a Boer War, but I have no idea when it was. I thought the Boer War was the 1800s. Could have been. Mm. Oh, that was before the first. Okay. Tom, can you step forward? Guilty. Guilty. What were you guilty of, spirit? Tom. Tom. Yes, yeah, Steph also heard bar war. <laughs> Damn. Damn, little Chelsea and Dam. What was you guilty of, Tom? Oh. Yeah. Please what, spirit? Do we have the spirit of the little children that drowned? Do we have one of the little children that drowned? I thought that little child, that, that like whisper in that child, I thought it said, here. Yeah. Here, right, here. Are you here with us? He did, he, did that say Mary then? I don't know. I will, I will read in chat. Bloody jump then. I thought this thing was walking down then and it was all top. <laughs> Is that Mary? Do we have Mary with us? No. 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 What's your name, please? Castillo. I don't know. I didn't hear it. I'm, well, I will read in chat then, see if anybody else sends anything. Hi. Hello? Are there any little children here? <laughs> can, one of, can one of those little children tell us what the name is, please? Lee? <laughs> Wanting us to leave. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do your team then. Again, I will read it in chat again. Help. Because they're 30 seconds behind, I'm reading what they're putting and trying to work out <laughs> if I heard the same as what they did. children if you are here with us little children would you like to make yourself be known yeah try and move one of the objects on the bench Break. We don't want you to break them, no. Especially not the big one. Can you walk me to the white line? Can you sit next to the red lights, alright? Can you sit down on that bench and have a conversation with us? 
You want to touch the red light? I thought that said shiv them. Damn. No, Steph, I got Nana's with me with it being wet. Um, I didn't want it to get ruined. No, no. We're no. moving from this place in a bit. We're going to be walking round. Are we? <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> no, no, yeah. We might just give you cameras and we might stop here. Yeah. If we walk away, Spirit, you might not have the chance to communicate with us again. Yes, touch the red, touch red light. I just heard the copying. Deep or Dean? It's a bit um, with rain, Steph. It's a, if we do an EVP, all we're going to pick up is the rain. But we can try. Yeah, do you want to try an EVP? Yeah, you want to try an EVP, yeah, guys? Now put it more this side, John, because it's wet over there. Let's try over this side. Oh, that's right, you're hitting my hand. It's a cold and tonight. It's very I'm cold. I'm telling you now, with this snow, it's raining that. Mm. Which one have we got? <laughs> oh, I've got Olympus. That'll do. So John's just getting his um, EVP out, so we're just going to have a quick I EVP fish. Right, guys, I'm going to hold we're it up bit, so you can see it. Are we ready, guys? Yeah, we're ready. All right. What is it? 10 second delay? Yep. 10 seconds before we have to have the EVP session one, the cemetery. Good evening, spirits. My name's John. I'm Lindsay. I'm Ellen. I'm Wenda. We mean you no harm or disrespect. We're just here to communicate with you and find proof of the afterlife. Could you step forward and tell us your name? Could you tell us how old you are? What's your name? Can you communicate with us through the devices that we've got? Do you know what this cemetery is called? Are you buried here? Are you a child? That's it. Okay, so we're just going to play that back. I'm guys. waiting for you to ask a question. That's no. what. <laughs> Couldn't you think of one? <laughs> no, no, I no, in your brain just goes. <laughs> yeah. Your brain just like went. <laughs> what? Yeah. I asked a question. I think somebody just asked that. Yeah, I can't remember that. I thought we're out or whether it was. Mm -hmm. I think that we're out. Pity that cat can't speak, mm. isn't it? Actually, it might do. Can we just. Give it a go at least, can't you? Yeah. Never thought of doing this. What? Playing with the speakers? Yeah. yeah. Can you? It's got a microphone, hasn't it? Look at you! It's bright eyes, you saw that! That's right, good. I hope it works. I don't know. I've mentioned it in the Right, I'm trying to. You know what this cemetery is called? Oh, yeah. I'm going to, re going to re rewind it and start from the beginning. Breaker. EVP session three. Is it now? No. There we go. EVP session one, the cemetery. Good evening, Spirits. My name's John. I'm Lindsay. I'm Ellen. 
You need no harm or disrespect. We just here to communicate with you and find proof of the afterlife. Can you step forward and tell us your name? The cemetery is cold. No. No. I could have heard a few things, but it sounded different on recording than when we put it on the speaker. When we put it on the speaker, it actually sounded like wind noises. Yeah, yeah, there were a lot right. of wind noises. Yeah. Do you know that? That's right, we've thrown it on speaker, that, because it's like a wind noise, so it's speaking over the season, that. Yeah, you just can just hear to it. show how it can manipulate a sound. I did hear something at first when I first played it, and then when they said what, put it on speaker, I never even thought of ever doing that before, wait. Um, so we put it on speaker, and when I played it back again, Oh, you said, do you know what the semi school? I thought I heard a voice. I think it was just wind, because that's all I could hear. Flash, what? I just saw a flash come, like, it was like a white flash that went right down that path. No, because I wouldn't look, what, behind me? Yeah. No. You know where this post is? Where that post goes up, right. it's like a white, well, that big of and it yeah. like shot down. That post, that, that black post, that little black post yeah. there. Just off grass behind it, it was like a white light that like shot down grass. There. Yeah, it is, Gemma. That's brilliant. I never, never even thought of that. We've been carrying that speaker around forever, and I've never thought about putting. Um, go on. EVP, EVP on it. Oh. Right. Th do we think it stopped enough now to have a wander around? <laughs> I'd say, well, it stopped. Ellen, would you just take hold of the live feed while I put the equipment away? We're going on walk around. I'm going to take, we're going to take you for a walk around and just show you around this place for a minute because it's absolutely amazing, this place. Um, I do have lots of daylight photos of this place, guys. So if we don't manage to get to show you, um, I will do a um, camera roll on it tomorrow um, or later tonight and get some pictures of it for you. Oh, I'm just going to take the gear to Lindsay a minute. No, you don't have to, you're not going to have to go anywhere. I'm just standing here. Oh. I just need... My hands have gone like... Your hands have gone cold. Cold, you know, like... Cause it's you... freezing. Oh, my God. I'm so cold. Um, but, yeah, we're going to take you for a little wander um, round uh, the cemetery and let you look at some of these. Honestly, like, the, when we were coming in, there's a certain part that drops down. I don't know whether we're going to try and get round to that part. Um... But the graves are stunning. They're absolutely stunning. Um, there's one, uh, and as we're going back, we'll show it you. And there's like, um, it's like it's not marble, but it's like a lady, and she's laid, and she's got a baby in arms. Um, and it's like I've just never seen. A, I've never seen been to a cemetery that's got this kind of feel to it. This. Um, like very Victorian <laughs> kind of era, evening my lovelies. Um, but yeah, so, um, and I'll pass you back up to John. And uh, do you like my hat? Oh, you can't see it. It just says uh, ETA Paranormal on the top. It's right cool. Um, John says ETA Paranormal. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, yes, yeah, so do some vape smoke, John. We will do, we'll just move from here and go a bit for, oh my bugger me, that's blooming fireworks. <laughs> Don't know if you can see these. That might have been pop we heard earlier, yeah. that you know. There you go, fireworks, guys.
All right, we'll come in. Child and poverty. Well, that's quite relevant. Mm -hmm. yeah. Nearly got up, nearly, nearly. She wheel spinning again. <laughs> nearly. She normally wheel spins, isn't it? So we're just going to show you around the uh, cemetery a little bit. Um, that one there is one of the six listed monuments within the cemetery. Yeah. Rather, yeah, I'll give you that a minute. Rather than show you at fireworks, I will, I'll, I'll show you a bit of history. We can all see fireworks, we'll do a fireworks one night. Yeah, we'll have a fun This time. is a, what is it, listed, grade two listed building, this one? Yeah, listed, the grade two listed monument. Grade two listed monument. That one. It tells you on that little plaque there. So this is the Joseph Smith Monument. And this is at the bottom end of Hulton, the town. They did. They knew, they knew ETA were coming and they knew White Rose Paranormal were coming so they got fireworks out just yeah. to welcome us to the city. Yeah. So you can just see it just says on there, Joseph Smith. On that plaque. Oh, you can just go. Just, just. Make it out. Oh, died at age 57. Bottom it says. <laughs> That's 30 foot, that one, is it? 30 foot high, that one. Yeah. You heard a little girl? No, there's no little girls living here anyway. This is, place is absolutely amazing. Yeah, if any of you guys are sensing anything, please put it in the chat. I mean, look at these. And they're all like that. Absolutely amazing. There should be names all around that one, it seems to think, Stephen. That, not that one, you know, the big one, the Stephen, Joseph, Stephen one. Sorry guys, that's me with the vape. Look at these. They're absolutely amazing. And these here that are at this side here that you can see are some of the smaller ones in here. <laughs> yep, what you message me tomorrow, Alan, we'll talk about it. You going on Sunday or are you going before Sunday to see if we can get in Sunday? Yeah, somebody's having a good time anyway. More fireworks over there, guys. I mean, it's not just these big monuments at one side. You're actually, you know, an elf. I mean, look at the amount there. Do you know, Lindsay? Yeah. These guys just don't know how far we go to entertain and we even bring them fireworks. <laughs> no! <laughs> Rather amazing. But all so huge and beautiful. They're all absolutely massive, Cheryl. Honestly, I've never seen anything like this. I know there is other places like this in other cities, but this one. I mean, all the ones I've done in Sheffield and that area, there's nothing like this that I've seen. I mean, this one as well, I'll show you this one. This is one that um, Lindsay and Ellen and uh, Wendy were telling you about.
better than what I remember her. This guy's is the picture I put onto you earlier, saying we were coming to a, a cemetery. I mean, there's loads of names on this yeah, one, isn't there? Yeah, loads of names on this one. A lot of Sarahs. <coughs> yeah. Oh no, Catherine, that one, Sarah there. I thought yeah. I'd seen two Sarahs. Might be. And then there's a little at the top cross for Jesus. Absolutely wonderful. So it's stunning here. It's a stunning place. Imagine coming here when it's light, John. I know, I bet it's amazing. We're we'll have to come up here one day when it's light. Yeah. Another one here. Craftsmanship yeah. that's gone into, you know, sculpture, some of yeah. these headstones, some of these yeah, monuments. Is absolutely amazing. Yeah. This is another listed one here. With a, they all got the little stake pole yeah. things. And the in total that's got these little stakes. And this one's the William Mawson. Monument. <laughs> Look. Well, Cliff, how high is that one? I'd say about 20. Look. It's blue plaque in the middle. The William Mawson monument. I do have photos of all six. Yeah. You'll have to put them as on if you don't mind. Yeah, like I say, I'll do you a camera roll tomorrow. Marvellous. That'll be great, Thank wouldn't it? Thank you. Like I said, they're just everywhere. It's wind blowing because they want us to be. Oh, a bit. From behind us. So we need to turn round. So we're going to do it in front of Eugenia? Yeah, in yeah. front of Eugenia. That's where when we came last time. Now, I don't want some, yeah. any comments about no, this name. I don't want any comments about this name. No, either. we don't. No hysterics. Either. No, no hysterics. hysterics. It's exactly what it says. It's un undoctored. But have you seen a fanny? <laughs> have you seen? We know it says Eugenia, but it looks like you've seen her. I have no idea. That way, yeah. Which way am I going to stand then? We are getting covered in the uh, vape. At side, like, you know, if we stand like this, yeah. then they can just screenshot it. Take some screenshots, guys, see if we can catch anything. This is the method that ETA use a lot on this. Um, we do, and we know that it's pareidolia, yeah. but yeah. sometimes things have got caught. Yeah. And it's but just amazing what can get caught on it. Yeah. Yes, Steph, you have. Well, it's we just have winds, winds just changing. changing. That way now. Yes, Steph, we have been here before. It's going all up him, look. Going all up at Pleasant. No. <laughs> at least it's not there. We'll try a bit further down when we if we go into a dip. We'll try that again in a bit. It's not going right well at the minute. I'm trying to cover, keep my hands covered. <coughs> I need better gloves. <laughs> I need finger gloves, not well, fingerless. These are amazing. I mean, that one as well. I don't even know. I'm not going to... Look at that one. This one's not one of the listed ones, no. but... Right, look at the craftsmanship and the carvings on the outside of it. Do we want to uh, try spirit boxes as we're walking? Or? Yeah, can do. I'll get mine out. I'm going to try the spirit box as we're walking round. I'll take you to the side where the chapels used to stand. Yeah? Yeah. Have they all gone now? There's not none. Oh, they've gone. Good evening. Thank you for sharing. Luella. I never even knew that like places like this really were within monuments. I've never seen them before. 
No, you don't. It's like you've been cooked somewhere. Yeah. Will do, I'm going to go back and put a bit. We're just trying to get you down here. Spirits can use this device in my hand to communicate with us. Some sky news. Yeah. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put aerial down. I put the aerial totally down and away. Can you try and use this device in my hand to communicate with us, to speak to us? Oh, I'm hoping it is. I don't think it is, you know. Evening, Tina. Underground. Can you use this device in my hand? Can you tell me your name through it? So let's go a long way around because there's some stairs at rail ends you can't. Wow, oh guys, just turn that off for a minute because this is stunning. Absolutely stunning. Did you like us? Did you hear Lindsay then, guys? Did you hear what she said? Well, they just decide whether they're going that way. I think you will. Uh, I'm just going to show you guys this. Look at this. Can't even. Good evening, Rachel. Yeah, you can hear you, yeah. Do you guys want us to come back here in the day at one weekend so you can see it better? Oh, wow. Well, you've got one of them thingies there, look, for your phone. Yeah, that's one of them list of monument things. Seen this one, guys? It's just amazing this place. What did they say about coming back in the daytime? Nobody said, yes, that would be amazing. Yes, please, Deanna. That would be Brill. Yes, it's a great place. Yeah, we'll definitely come back here in the day so you can see it better, guys. A bard? Yeah, it's, it's not a, it's not a list of monuments, but it's one of the well-known uh, 
um, you know, popular. Yeah. Mm. Oh, so if yes is yeah, we will. We'll come back here today, guys. Because more like an explore, 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 exploration. An exploration. This one. Yeah. I mean, this is that. There's just so much to see. We walk down the side of this one. I mean, that's the side of that. It's huge. Never seen anything like this. <laughs> Forward. Yeah. Backward. If you're going to want to. That's grass, though, isn't it? It is, but I don't know. There's a mass yeah. grave somewhere. Yeah, this could be mass grave area. Right. But it does say that the mass grave. <laughs> um, <laughs> I am. I'm going to. I'm going to we we'll back down to this Illingworth one and I'm going to put the REM pod and the balls near it and see if we can get any any action. No worry Lorraine, glad you managed to make it. I'm not going over, I'm not going to cross. I'm alright on this foot because it's quite soft. When we came and we did it, we went to Lone Vigil here, didn't we? I did it. Yeah. Did you? Oh, this one. Yeah. Yeah, I sat on there and did my own. Do you want to do a Lone Vigil, Lorraine? Me? Yeah. I'll do a Lone Vigil here if you guys are going for a wander. I'm only thinking if you want to do one, we'll just walk down bottom. Just walk yeah, which way are you going? Are you going back that way and up to the top? Have a look at this one here. Oh, uh, yeah, we'll not go far from you. All right. Yeah, we'll go look at this other one around here that's still one of the listed ones. We've already been. Not area from Ash Grave, it has a stone in front of it. Alright, that's not the area from Ash Grave, Cliff says. Right, I'm here on my own. Do it for you guys. Put the balls down. Oh, do you know, I can't fight REM pod. I fight REM pod. Just got to fight Ariel now. Do, 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 do. Talk amongst yourselves for a minute, guys. Put the REM pod there. There you go, look. Put the REM pod with a flashy ball at each side. On there. Turn this down a little bit so you can see it better. Get the spirit box out and we'll try a bit of spirit box. This is amazing. It has a door, yes. We'll all get the spirit box out if I can find which. Thank you, Deanna. We do try. What's that? That's phone. I think it is Rebecca, yeah, it's like a uh, mausoleum, is it they call it? There was something in front of the door, but it was stolen. Do you know, some people just have no... I don't know what I've done with my spirit box. Did I put it in that pot? I might put it in my pocket. I did, put it in my pocket. All right. Not necrophonics, Christopher? Okay, I can do necrophonics. Or spiritus. Necrophonics or spiritus, guys. 
Which one would you prefer? You tell me guys, necrophonics or spiritus? We'll do dead wave in a bit because it's that takes some set that takes some setting up. And I've been messing about long enough, haven't I? Oh, I can smell like burning. We'll do dead wave in a bit, Carol. Uh, only because it's just Lindsay likes that one. Spiritus. We'll do both anyway. We've done necrophonic. I'll, I'll have a go with Spiritus and then we'll go back onto necrophonic. No, people don't care, it's, it's just wrong. I forgot the guy's name now. Yeah. I had a knock in then, it's hiding me. Alfred? <laughs> it's Mausoleum on Monument, it's beautiful. Yes, you must oh. be a very important person. Can you try and speak to me through this device? Or affect one of the objects on the floor? Approach the blue light. Some more lights will come on it, alarm. But it'll not hurt you. Move one of the balls. Alfred, are you here? Would you like to communicate with me? I'm sorry that somebody tried to damage this monument to you. Some people just have no respect. <laughs> Why are you? Why am I? I'm here to try and communicate with you, to give you a voice, to find your story, and to find proof of the afterlife. Can you please set phones? Communicate with me, Alfred. Uh, All right, though, I'll be two minutes and I'll come back around. So if I go up them steps. Something above the door? Was something stolen from above this door? Or round it? It's thrilling with? This is an amazing place. Turn the light, guys, and you can see it better. Hold on, guys. Let me see which way it went. See if you can get some screenshots, guys. Yes. Um. Oh, 
this one. Alfred, well, Mr. Illingworth, could you show yourself in this mist, this vape? Now I'm going to leave in a minute. Yeah. Well, leave this place, not this this monument. Yeah. Could you just please say hello? Yeah. Tell me your name. Yeah. Or say goodbye. Goodbye, Mr. Lingworth. Goodbye. I had a lady voice saying something about get out of, get us out of this. This is amazing. I think you said your name again, Alan. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right. This is where the chapels used to be here. Yeah. No. Good night, Kimmer. So what do you think of it then? I, I think, think it's, it's amazing. amazing. But in the city where we are, for this to be here. Yeah. Yeah. Let's turn that off. We're just gonna get a drink, guys. Just gonna get a quick drink. I don't know whether to let you look go and get a drink. And you stop here for a bit. Yeah. Could do if you want. Um, <laughs> How many we have walkie talkies, but um, just tell Cliff to message Wonder if you need us. Yeah. Yeah. Um, just tell Cliff to make. Do you want torch? No, I'm alright. I've got mine. Well, do you, right. Is that nice you want to stay yeah. yeah. The girls are going to get a drink. I'm going to get warm in car. <laughs> Cliff, you if they need me or anything. You'll message him, won't you? Or if I need them. But if you let Cliff know when you're coming back in, Cliff can message me and I'll come and meet you around here. All right. All right, I'm here on my own. The girls have gone back to the car. So let's have a wander around and see what we can see. No worry, Claire. Claire Bear. Walking around the graveyard on my own. Alright, go on then. I said I'd put Dead Wave on for you guys. Let me see how much charge I've got left in this voice. Well charged. It's, so it's still 75%. I've not got to connect it yet. Although I'm probably better I'm connecting it now. Thank you, Joanna. Um Right, I'm just going to try and put this other phone that I'm using with Dead Wave on charge as well on the power brick. So 
so that it doesn't switch itself off because this phone has a habit of switching itself off when it no it's not snack time for me snack time for the girls if we were doing something like we was Friday night where we were like here for four or five hours Elizabeth's following me I think right well that way she'll ask her when we get the dead wave on Oh my god, this is so difficult when you're on your own. Alright, dead wave. This takes me two seconds, well, a minute just to set the settings up on the dead wave. Although I'm getting quicker at it. I don't know where they all go now. Sorry guys, that's a bit loud, I know. Right. Oh, I've turned it volume off now. No. I have to, all right, no worries. Alfred, Elizabeth was Alfred's mum. Elizabeth? Are you going to follow me around here? I don't know what this way, because we haven't been this way. I don't know what is this way. Night, Amy. Do you follow me? Can you come and communicate with me? I mean, you know how I'm disrespect in, what, in no way? I'm just looking for proof of the afterlife and to give you a voice to, to tell your story if you'd like. <laughs> Could you tell me your name? Such a beautiful place. <laughs> Elizabeth? Is it Elizabeth Illingworth? My name's John. Mean you no harm or disrespect. I am just here to communicate with you. Oh, it's very cold. Could you tell me your name, please? Donate as the last one. Not far off. You tell me whose mausoleum this is? There's no name on it that I can see. Can you tell me your name? What family? <coughs> family this mausoleum belongs to? <coughs> Such a beautiful place.
There's over a hundred thousand burials here, interments, whatever you want to call them. I don't know if it, the full graveyard still does, but when they when they originally bought the land, it was 26 acres. 26 acres of land. Oh, go back to that little cross. Little cross. Oh, it's like trees, isn't it? Oh. That little cross? Alan? That one? Just said Alan when I said Alan. Is there a Derek here? You Derek, are you here? Oh, okay. It's on junction. On junction! Oh, my feet are freezing. Why works it that way now? There's probably something going off somewhere. Where is it tonight? Is it, isn't it? Oh. Is it that one, Alan? That's near the junction. But then there's that one. Ooh. Loads of crosses. It's a graveyard. First one, not that one. Oh, first one. Trees and wood. Crosses in graveyards. You know, you're like me running all over. That one. I'm not moving till I get an answer. It is, it's too noisy for EVPs, unfortunately. Can you tell me whose grave this is? George? George or Mary? I can see your names on there. Do you sit forward and communicate with me? Mary? Mary Hodgson Tetley? Tetley? Not that I know of Amy. I have no idea. No, there's no holiday. It's mine, the man said. This is your grave, is it, George? Is this George? I, don't, I can't get down. There's another name on top. Oh no, that might, no, it's in loving memory of. Are you here, George? Is this your grave? Somebody heard a man's voice say it's mine. I mean, you know how my disrespect, George. Could you step forward and communicate with me, please? Teenager? I can't see Alan. I don't get any closer. Uh, no. It's George and Mary, presume a husband and wife. 
1805 to 1875. So he was 70, George was 70. And 86, Mary was. Is there a spirit here who's 15 or 17 years old? I mean, there's one here. I don't know if it's this one, Alan. There's no one here, but there's no actual stone on it. No, I'm not walking across. Oh, I can walk across this bit because that's not. I don't know what that says there. No, 61. Is there a teenager here, the spirit of a teenager? I know that when you used to work in the cotton mills, in the mills... It's definitely not your house, really. When you used to work in the mills, the average life expectancy of the labourers was 17 years old. That was average. So there's a young boy or girl here. Is Stephanie? <laughs> Stephanie, are you here? I mean you no harm. Priest. Priest. We're hearing bishop and priest come through. <laughs> What's the relevance f for Bishop? No worries, Sam, take care. Yes. David and Mary. Hello. John Ramsden. It's a shame one of the pillars is missing. Help. Who needs help? What help do you need? Some of these monuments and headstones are absolutely yeah, so amazing. Wow. Is there a spirit of a young boy here? Cross is beautiful. Soil. Your remains in the soil. It just goes on forever. You could get lost in here. I really said that. Me? I get lost anyway. Oh, oh no, it was still great. I saw something move down there, but I think it was just a gravestone that went behind, a light went behind it when I moved. Elizabeth! You still here? Or the spirit of the young boy? Don't 
turn that one off. Put Necro back on. Gone wrong decision. Yeah. Rave. No raving in here. Oh, my hands are freezing. Don't move. That was 30 seconds ago though, I've moved since then. Spirits talking about being alive, yeah, they could be. Who's the young boy or the young child that's following me? Okay, you can't really. This to we'll see if I can get my torch because do you know what I can see? And what, ooh, what you guys can see is this light here just doesn't do this justice at all. Maybe look guys. It's just amazing. So many monuments just so close together. So big. I've got gloves. Yeah, man. Oh. They're fingerless. I need to have them fingerless so I can touch phone screen. Good left. What about down here? Oh, we're getting some good interactions or responses. Down here. We might rather than go that side this time. This is the other. I think when they said there were six all together. I know, it is, it's beautiful, Courtney. I've never seen a graveyard as beautiful. There's six, I think she said, all together. Um, listed monuments. And that's another one. It's amazing. Could you please step forward and communicate with me? Shame. Such a shame about some of the monuments, some of the gravestones here. Extremely old now, though. That's another one, it's huge. Leave. Leave? Did you just tell me to leave? I don't mean you any harm. I want to hear to communicate with you. I just want proof of the afterlife. Is George here? something in that tree there. Oh. Yeah. That's a shame. I think it's just drips I can hear dripping from the tree. Oh. 
Girls have gone to pub. That's about right. All right, leave Johnny Graveyard, he'll be fine. Not a problem, John will be cool. I told you to believe. I do believe in the afterlife. Could you tell me a story? Could you tell me what happened to you? Uh, it's but it's on it, so. <sighs> Alan, this place is huge. The original graveyard was over 26 acres. It could be anywhere. It's like trying to find a tree in a forest. I heard George sleep, woman sad, Derek again. Who's the woman that's sad? No need to be sad. Tell me why. Tell me why you're sad. Can you tell me why you're sad? Are you looking for somebody? Yes. Yes. Who are you looking for? Who are you looking for? Did you say my name? I know, I'm only messing with you, Alan. It's just an joke about trees and woods. Who's the lady that's sad? Why are you so sad? Are you trying to find somebody? Is your story sad? I will do, Alan. Yep. Yep. Is your story sad? Is this Elizabeth? Is this Elizabeth? Is it Elizabeth Illingworth? <laughs> you Alfred's mum? <laughs> Are you Mary? Are you Mary? <laughs> Can Mary step forward and communicate? If you need any energy, use some of mine. I thought that just said John Brown. No. Hmm. So you know my name? Yeah. Or I believe that's just what I heard. Did you say my name? Oh. 
so you know me. Everybody heard you say my name. But I don't know your name. Oh, that name's quite a common name. Was that your name? Is it just coincidence? We have the same name? I mean, you know, harm or disrespect. Elizabeth or Mary. Who's asking for help? Johnson, Johnson. Benjamin Ellingworth. Benjamin. Are you related to Alfred? Stop. Stop. Who's the lady that asked me to stop? Hold on, I've got to go back a minute, guys. She's dead. Johnston. Dawson. Alright, it's alright. Somebody said Dawson. That one's Dobson. I couldn't remember exactly what somebody had put. Could it have been Dobson, not Dawson? Who was the lady that asked me to stop when I asked if Benjamin and Alfred were related? Were they brothers? Father and son? Did they not get on? Is that why you don't like me discussing them together? Money guessing. Could you go and stand on the steps and see if we can see you? Just go and stand on those steps. Show yourself to us. I'm trying my best to see you. I'm saying I should see. But I don't see you. I'd like to see you. Can you stand in the middle of those steps? Show yourself on this camera, on this device in my hand, this object.
I don't, I don't know, Cliff. Somebody else put Dawson. I just saw that the, the, when I turned around, I couldn't remember if it was Dawson. Who needs help? Do you need help? If you need help, I need you to tell me. I also need you to tell me what I can do to help. What do you need help with? This is a site of one of the old chapels. I'm going to put this phone down on this bench a minute. Do you know? Do we know where that is, Cliff? Have we any idea? Don't say nurtury. No. There's a device there you can use. Debunked. What's debunked? My balls are rolling. That's me that's setting the rem pad off, guys. I put the rem pod and the flashy balls on the bench. Could you try? you try and I fake one of those devices, one of those objects on the bench? Could you try and move no. one of the balls? Or walk up to the blue light? Could try and touch it? Touch. Touch. No. That's a child here, there's some toys on there that you can play with. That one is Yeah. Ooh. That's pretty cool. Girl. Did him. Can't be here because this is where Chapel was. Hello. Girls are on the way back. Can you uh, affect one of the objects on that bench, please? Thanks, Alan. Just try and affect one of the objects on that bench, please. Just to let me know that you're here. None of them will hurt you. Well, just give me proof that you're here and you want to communicate with me.
Pizza and Jaffa cakes. <laughs> Please? Please try and affect one of the devices. <laughs> Night, Sandy. Right, even though Claire's got them, Claire Bear. Sorry guys, I'm it's because I've only got one hand. Even though Claire Bear's gone, pizza, I know I could, I could murder a pizza. I'm going to try an attempt. No, we're not on back sitting car. Come to car. Wet and cold, come back in 10 minutes. Alright, no worries. Right, I'm just going to do the Paratech then, guys. We'll get some Paratech love out. Paratech loaded. Started scanning. Say. Say? Can you try and affect one of the devices on the bench, please? Or use this device in my hand? Try and communicate with me. You can make it say different words. Let's try, please. Uphold. Uphold. Or approach that blue light. Try and move one of the balls. Paralysis. Mini Paralysis. You only have to touch these. Really? That's sensitive. Just touch them. Oh, there you go. And it will go off. We'll start flashing. Just try and touch them. Feel bad. Try. Feel bad? Why do you feel bad? Died. You feel bad because she died? Do you believe it was before your time? Did you die young? Can you tell me how old you were? Were you under 20 years old? Like, were you under 20 years old? If you was under 20 years old, can, can you make one of the objects on the bench light up? Holy. This is a holy place. It's consecrated ground. Try and make one of the objects move or light up. Unit. Unit. We were soldier. What war did you fight in? Fan. Fan. Tell me what war you fought in, if you're a soldier. Yeah, I did. Alright. Scanning started, sc scanning stopped. I've been told, I'm instructed, to walk back over towards the girls. Well, thank you for communicating with me. What's it said? What? 
Oh. It said name. No. Ooh. So okay, Von. Well, I've dropped my balls. I hope I broke it. Wait, oh, yeah, look, it still works. Oh, it's mucky. I did answer you, Lindsay. Three times. Oh, what's happened here? Oh, I turned the light down, didn't I? <laughs> really? Oh, big puddle, big puddle. These are so amazing. Gotta come back here in day. So much to see. Preferably a day when it's not raining. Right, I'm just gonna see what the girls are up to. Dirty flashy balls, yep. Don't tell everybody. Lovely building as well. Right. Ooh. Turn the security light on. My balls have finally dropped. Cheers for that, Alan. Right, mate, you. You're welcome, Cliff. Do, do, do. Well, I hope we've all enjoyed it anyway, up to now. So, uh, I thought they were coming back, but apparently I'm going over to the car. Oh, my feet are freezing. two seconds guys we're nearly there oh. right shall pass you to Lindsay Girls are fine. Hello, hello. I've put my hat back on because I said, oh, Sugar John's walking up to the car. You can't see my hair. <laughs> told me to come back so to lovely, car. ladies and gentlemen. Have you enjoyed tonight? We can see you on camera. <laughs> <laughs> Only a short. Awesome night. <laughs> we do, a, yeah, it is a short, well, it is short compared to other nights when we are out and about. Um, but yeah, you've done two hours. Um, but uh, yes, obviously, Wendy's got work. Um, yeah, I'll pass it me because I can. It's wet through, that's all oh, I'm thinking. I'll keep that on my knee because it's wet through and yeah, then that's all right. Yeah, yeah. Well, only goes in kit bag anyway, oh. down in sandwich bag. Um, so yes, and we've got a an hour and a half. An hour. An hour. An hour. An hour. An hour. An hour and a half drive back. Oh, I'm so glad you guys have enjoyed it. Um, I don't know. Angle that camera differently. <laughs> yeah, you're not one foot camera. Sorry, love. There you go. Yeah, I'll turn it. Is that better? That's better. You can't see me. You can't see her now, look. I'm just sitting here sticking my tongue out. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you've all had a good night. Um, and we are going to come back and do a daytime investigation. Um, it's been ace, well. John, mate. Especially in the cold and wet. Go home with the pizza now. No, we've got pork chops in slow cooker for when we get home. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> you've leaned in. <laughs> but... <laughs> But yeah, um, it is, it's been crazy, but I can't wait to come back here um, in the daytime and do a daytime investigation, I think. Um, you didn't see half of what's actually in this place. Um, we didn't cover half of it. <laughs> no, we didn't, been we awesome. We covered about 
brought back memories. Oh, bless. Yeah. I hope happy members there, Martin. Um, you've got a lizard in the back sticking her tongue out, Cliff. <laughs> <laughs> Great yeah. night. Again, just let me shoot my card, do I? Yeah, um, <laughs> but yes, so uh, is there a single grave there? Uh, what do you mean, is there a single grave, grave Alan? There's loads, um, but there is actually, I don't know if John managed to get round to it, but there is actually a war memorial, isn't there? Yeah. Um, I'm not sure if John managed to find that part, but uh, yeah. It's yeah. not that far. It's not, well, it's not that far, it's just side. It's on the side of this wall. Um, is there a single grave there? There's loads of single graves, Alan. I don't get the single grave. Right, the grave on its own. Oh, a grave on cross. its own. Um, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, John in pub next time. <laughs> right, I met Wendy Sunday night. She came into my chippy, Yvonne. Yes. Yes, give him a wave. Hello. Hi, Yvonne. What's the chip shop called? The Golden Fish at Liversidge. There you go. Anybody going near Liversidge, drop into Golden Fish and uh, say hello to Yvonne. And uh, apparently, best chips and fish ever. So uh, well, we'll there be you calling go. in. We will, we will be calling in to see you. Yes, not we tonight, will. Not tonight. We'll... No, not tonight. <laughs> yeah. But I've been uh, using the Golden Fish for on and off for forty years. There we go. Forty years. Mm, sure My you. goodness, you should be getting your chips for a penny. <laughs> Morning, years Messi. Ago. No, we probably did 40 years ago, yeah. yeah. Uh, where were we tonight? Um, Somebody's already put it in the chat. We are in. A, we have been into a cemetery. I'm not going to get location just yet Somebody's because we are. Chat, oh, is it already in chat? Where are we, ladies? We are at Undercliff Cemetery in Undercliff at Bradford. Yeah, Undercliff Cemetery. That's where we are tonight. So uh, yes, so rent a fob. Rent a fob. One loved to. <laughs> Oh dear. Good night, guys. Thank you. Enjoyed it. Yes, thank you so much for joining. Uh, it's good night from White Rose Paranormal. Night, night guys. It's good night from me. Good night, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. And it's good Stay night safe. from me. So we shall see you again. Um, don't know about tomorrow, and we'll see what weather's like Friday or Saturday. So uh, take, guys, my lovelies, and sweet dreams. Thank you for joining. And we'll see you soon. Bye. 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 Bye.